Where are we going, guys? My family and I went on a trip last summer to attend my cousin's wedding. We got to the airport early so my dad didn't have to stress about missing our flight. Hey guys, I'm Will. Today I will be covering my time spent in England. I've been putting this video off for a while now because of school and other things. I really enjoyed my time spent in the UK and I miss it so much. I hope to go back again sometime in the future, maybe for longer. But until then, let's enjoy this adventure. England. It's a seven hour flight, is it? I don't know. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> yes, it is. Once we landed in England, my uncle picked us up and drove us back to his home in Wooster Park. We spent the rest of the day relaxing, getting groceries, exploring, and spending time with our family from England. Shortly after, we left to go to our Airbnb near Sutton. The following day, my sister invited me to go with her family to Hampton Court Palace, which is home to King Henry VIII. We left West Sutton Station and traveled all the way down to Hampton Court. We had lunch at an English pub where I had my first English beer. Then we walked over to the palace. We got to see the world's largest grapevine and some incredible fancy jewels, including an actual royal crown. We even explored through a maze and play area called the Magic Garden. The second day, my family and I went on our first trip to London to watch the Lion King musical in theater. After the musical finished, we walked to the train station. We made a stop to grab some dinner at Witherspoon, another British pub. That was a lovely dinner at Rains, where were we? Rains Park. Rains Park. The Lion King, it was fantastic. The next day, I spent with my mom. We took a map with us and hopped on a train to London. We left the station and walked to Buckingham Palace. to St. James Park and had some sandwiches. Sat in them for 20 minutes. I know what happens when we share with friends like you. What's up? After we walked around, we headed to the London Eye. And saw the amazing views it had to offer. We made our way back to the station to go back to our place. The next two days, I ventured to London by myself. I left the station and hopped on the city, but I walked to the Tower Bridge. I laid down on the glass floor, then I walked outside to get to the engine room. Made my way to the Sky Garden, which was free to go up at 6 o'clock. the girls in front of me for some directions on where the station was. They helped me out and asked if I wanted to join them to the pub. I got the chance to meet pretty cool people that night and dance the night away. I went back to London for the last time, but I missed the train to get to London. And I met this awesome girl and we got on the next train to London. And we did a photo shoot. I 
also went to the Science Museum. I left London and made my last stop of the day in Bobleton, where I went to a pub for dinner and made some more friends. Finally, it was time to attend my cousin's wedding. Thank you so much for watching this video. I really appreciate my family bringing me along on this trip. Overall, this trip was amazing. I already missed it and I really want to go back already. Subscribe for more videos down the road. Please stay safe out there and remember, always choose your own adventure.